Hello and welcome to the Player Interact FSM Template tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how you can use the Player Interact FSM Template from the ecosystem in your own project. First thing I'm going to do is select Playmaker Editor, hit Alt-E to bring up the ecosystem. You can also bring up the ecosystem by selecting Playmaker, Add-ons, Ecosystem, Browser. Then I'm going to go over here to Filter, select Templates, and hit Browse. We already have Player Move and First Person Look templates in here, so lastly I'm just going to add this Player Interact just by hitting this get button. So I'm gonna hit import, I'm gonna close this, select our player, come down here and add a new FSM, hit edit, select this FSM, hit the little dot dot dot, find my player interact template, select it. Now we're using the player interact FSM template on our player game object. You'll see over here, it asks us for the player camera in this input slot. So I'm gonna drag and drop our camera right here. And let's just click to edit so we see what's happening inside of here. We have a get button down action here, which is using the fire one axis, which by default should be mapped to mouse clicking, a left mouse click. You can change this to whatever you want. And that will send us over here where it does a ray cast. And then it sends off an event to the object that the ray cast hit. So this is the important bit that you'll need to set up for interaction with objects in your own game. You'll see that the event being sent is interact event. I come over here to my events tab. You'll see it's a global event, interact event. So now if I do something like create a cube and I put this cube over here and I'll give it an FSM and I'll give it a transition, custom events, interact event. And then I'll send this interact event over to another state where I can do something like set material color. And I'll just change it to red. And then I'll add another interact event transition. So if I click it again, this time the set material color, we'll set it to blue. So by default, it should start off as blue and then it'll go back and forth. Okay, so I can hit play. Now if I click it, it turns red, it turns blue. So, so that's how this player interact FSM works. Anything that you want the player to interact with, the thing that should make the item or object in the world do its thing, whether you're opening a door, turning on or off a light, or interacting with an NPC, the thing that triggers that should just have a little interact event that sends off to the rest of those states that do whatever it is that you've programmed it to do. Okay, and that's how you can use the Player Interact FSM template from the ecosystem in your own games. Be sure to check out our other videos to learn all the various features of Playmaker. Links to more learning resources are in the description.